Hi, I'm Mike Hudson, director of the Museum of the American Printing House for the Blind. Today we're in front of Miss Helen Keller's desk here in the museum, and our Monday mystery object comes from the AFB Helen Keller archive. It is a silver scroll tube. Now this thing is about, oh, 10 inches long, maybe an inch and a half in diameter, and engraved into the side, it says, Dr and then in parentheses, Miss Helen Keller from the Blind Men's Association, Bombay, India. And then um, cast, carved into the sides of this beautiful scroll tube are uh, little cartouche, oval cartouches, and inside of those are carvings of, of three different buildings. And we're not sure exactly what these buildings are supposed to represent. Perhaps they're, they're buildings there from uh, Bombay or from the Blind Man's Association building. But this tube opens up, so the lid comes off. I'm gonna put that down here. And then inside of the tube is a scroll. There are actually multiple copies of the same scroll. Um, it is a a dedication from uh, the Blind Men's Association to Helen Keller. Helen and uh, her assistant, Polly Thompson, visited the Far East in early 1955, and they spent um, six or seven days in Bombay, India, visiting the schools for the blind, uh, the workshops, vocational workshops for the blind, and then um, she gave uh, several teas where she would meet with various uh, luminaries, the governor of the, of the state there, and uh, then she gave a big speech for the uh, National Blind Association um, in Bombay. She was traveling throughout the Far East, um, kind of, for one thing, gathering information on the institutions there, but she was also trying to encourage the national governments of India, Pakistan, Burma, the Philippines, Japan, to support uh, the institutions for the blind in their countries. And um, this is just one of the kinds of gifts that Helen got when she went on the road.